what is going on, guys? Base cut high. We're gonna get ready to drop some knowledge right on your forehead. Get ready to just, 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 just yeah, yeah. Okay. But anyways, here we are. Sniping, bog, cod forty master. You already know it's lit. That wasn't a headshot. Uh. They aren't about it. They aren't about it. But get ready to drop some good old knowledge right on your forehead. So there's a lot of I what's the what's the term I'm looking for? Next Call of Duty talk. You know, let's let's just bypass this year. Apparently Call of Duty 4 is not a big deal. Because I I personally I love this game. It's the first Call of Duty I ever played, so it makes me very, very, very happy just to just to, to get to get it in such a nice, beautiful, clear form. Man, I am the GOAT. But other than that, we use our 700 deck, playing Bog, the GOAT sniping map, and here we are, just chilling. But the next Call of Duty in my mind will definitely be, it's definitely going to be Modern Warfare 2. Let, let's, not, let's not pass that up. It's not going to be Black Ops 2, because that game still... It's still fairly newer as compared to Call of Duty 4. You gotta think Call of Duty 4 is like 10 years old. Black Ops 2 is only like 5. Maybe 6 if you like. I don't know. I... I don't know. It's been a while. Don't don't calculate me on years. But in recent hindsight, it seems everybody's like, Oh, we're gonna get a remaster next year. Yeah. Woo. Phenomenal. No. Not happening next year. Next year. This is going to be a Sledgehammer game, obviously. Sledgehammer Games is a studio. But they aren't going to do necessarily a remaster, as they're going to just try to make their own standalone title. Because if they were remaster stuff, it's either going to be Modern Warfare 3 or Advanced Warfare. And yet again, Modern Warfare 3 is in that area with Black Ops 2, where it's still kind of a recent game. Like, I would love to see Modern Warfare 3. That's definitely a Call of Duty I have a lot of memories on. That's one I could they bring that back and they bring back the face off 2v2s and stuff oh man that would be a a great game i'd play that game that i would drop every other game to play that but i personally think the next one is going to be call of duty modern warfare 2 and it's not going to come out say in the next year it's going to come out in like three when the next affinity war game comes out so infinite warfare 2 modern warfare 2 remaster hand in hand Maybe. I don't know. Probably not going to be in it for Warfare 2. I don't know. I actually like to see a Ghost 2. Just like kind of update it and give it kind of like the feel of, say, like the brightness and the intensity of, say, Infinite Warfare. And just call it Ghost 2. And I think it would actually be really good because that, that's the way I feel about Ghost. A lot of people seem to just not like Ghost. A lot of people don't seem to like Infinite Warfare either. And I'm just like, how can you hate these games? Like, they're not bad. Ghost is not a bad game. Everybody's like, oh, the time to kill is fast, and blah, blah, blah. And it, it's kind of, it's very similar to COD 4. And if you play Tactical TDM on Infinite Warfare, time to kill is very quick in that. Like, ridiculously quick, as compared to the, the actual game itself. There's a headshot of the night to 11. Already. Oh, man, I'm, I'm about it. But, but other than that, I think it'll be Modern Warfare 2. And I don't think that'll happen until... It's 2017. It probably won't happen until 2020. It, it'll be a while, just because of the simple fact that, you know, they're probably going to have Raven do it again, unless Raven becomes its own studio, and then we have a four-year cycle, but that's probably not going to happen. And then, the fact that that seems to be a very widely regarded Call of Duty, and if they do sell it as, say, a remaster, I hope they just sell it by itself. Because that... It seems to be the real problem with Call of Duty this year. It's just everybody doesn't know what to play. Like me, I don't know if I want to play COD 4 or if I want to play Infinite Warfare. Because Infinite Warfare's got that new tactical TDM game mode. And that's what I want to play. That's what I actually really like playing on that game. I don't like the game itself with like the boosting and stuff like that. But as long as I got that game mode, I continually find a way to play. That's all I play is that game mode. So, for me, it's all about just, you know them trying to I guess incorporate a better Call of Duty. I, I guess this kind of COD War was their way to save Infinite Warfare. 
in a way to kind of boost the sale, even though the sale number isn't really that high. I guess it's them just trying to save what they what they have. Don't know. That's not something I'm too sure about. I guess this was like their 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 sale in the hole. I don't know. Because I'm not a big fan of Future Stick. I don't like Modern Warfare. I don't like any of the new new qualities. I I like Infinite Warfare just because I feel like the movement is really uh, crisp. I mean, Black Ops 3 was good, don't get me wrong, but it was not my favorite. I've just never been good at Black Ops games. I've always been an Infinity War type guy. So, all the Modern Warfare games, Ghost, I like them all. Like, I, I cannot hate it. I actually really like Call of Duty Ghost. That's a three-piece right there. Oh man, I had it going. But anyways, that's just what I personally think. I personally think it's going to be more of a, uh, just a, 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 a time of waiting. I do, I do think the next quality will be boost on the ground, though. Just because the reception that COD 4 is getting, and, you know, games like Battlefield 1, things like that, where it takes you back instead of taking you forward, which seems to be the new standard is every game's taking you forward. Titanfall, Call of Duty. You know, they kind of had this futuristic thing, and then Battlefield 1 is definitely changing that by proving, hey, you know, we're going to outsell Call of Duty, blah, 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 and we're going to make it a pass game, and people are going to buy it. And they did that, which is just genius on their part, because I actually really love the game. Don't play it much anymore. I used to play it, like, before Call of Duty came out, the new one, Ricard 4 and all this dropped, I was all over it, dude. I got to, like, 60 in, like, two weeks. Like, I was... Well on to level, level 100 really quick. Get this no scope. Get that no scope. Ah, it's all good though. But yeah, anyways, that's just how I feel about what games would be the next party. But anyways, we're just gonna jump right into killing people once again. Oh no. Nope. Give it to him. Take the L. Take the L. Take the, take the flashbang. I don't even remember if you could shoot through the walls on this map. I just have a fond memory of some parts of the map and others. I don't know. I just like Call of Duty 4. I... It's Call of Duty 4. I... My KD would be better. Like, I have nearly a 2 in Infinite Warfare, but this game's their shipment, and it's kinda eh. Hey man, you wanna drop some KD? And then everybody I wanna play with, you know? That every time that someone advises you something, it's always, Hey man, let's play shipment 24 7 Like, I wanna play Fog. I wanna play Overgrown. I, I like the bigger maps. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a weirdo. Boy. Need those headshots though. Every time I get one, I get so enthralled. Check this. Check this. I don't know. I feel like this sway is so bad on R so it's compared to the M48 3. Don't know why. Aw, oh, dude, you're bad. You know, like, he came around the corner with this sniper, and he's like, oh, I'm gonna bust out that pistol. Get that freebie. Oh, I've got a hit marker. Chest shot. Oh. Oh. I don't know. A lot of the maps in this game that I found memories on, like, Overgrown and stuff. Overgrown and stuff. I remember playing them on Modern Warfare 2, actually, because they were in a map pack on that. And I actually remember playing them on there, and I have fond memories of playing those maps on that game than I do when actually playing them on COD 4, so... My mind is very bleak as a COD 4. Very bleak. I'm not gonna say I have the best quality of 4 memories in my mind. Because I do remember the M16. I, <laughs> it's, M16 and D is probably the only thing I can really remember from this game. Hey man, I, I can't take that. The, the they need to really fix that clad problem. I I'm not gonna say I could have just not got a clad, but I really think they should fix it because I know there's potential shots if I should get clads, and I don't. Running, running, running. flashbang. No. Oh. oh man, toe shot. God, I hate it. I hate airstrikes. Can't 
that's what's going on. I ended up playing this game more. Because I do want to get Exclusion Zone or whatever it's called. The Mastery Gamma. For this game. Um, I'm already almost there for Infinite Warfare. But I really need to try and go ahead and say, hey, you know, I need to get for this game. But I really don't have no one who wants to play this game. Everybody's like, hey man, let's play the new tactical mode on Infinite. And I'm like, you know, that's not a bad idea. Cause that's what I, it's, not, it's not bad. Because if you catch me... Plus it crouching, you'll see that I want to slide because you can still slide into no warfare on tactical. And that's what I'm I'm trying to do when I play this. It just it doesn't want to happen. Oh man, I can suck in my Oh I hate bananas, watermelons, and fruit. Dude, oh man. And as usual, I get to, I don't know what this is, man. I don't know what the game, the new formula is. If you're good, you get paired with bad teammates. And if you get, and if you're bad, you get paired with good teammates. I just can't get a good teammate anymore. I don't know. I, I need to start partying up with people all the time, but I don't want to do that because they want to talk and they want them to report. And it, it's, it's complicated. Okay, oh God. That guy's gonna kill me. Something's gonna kill me in this area. How's that meat? I was gonna kill by an airstrike, I was gonna kill by getting shot. I just picked. Oh man, he got destroyed. Oof. Can I jump on these? I don't know, for some reason I thought I could jump on those. Just... Bang. Give it to me. Bang. Give it to me. It's next. Ah, uh, can't shoot him through the dirt. And we lost, of course, you know? That happens, but if you guys do enjoy, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Almost to 50 subs, you know, I'm gonna do a, a sneaker unboxing. Not a sneaker unboxing, but just uh, looking at my sneaker collection and stuff for 50 subs, you know. I think that'd be fair to kind of start off. Just something small, not nothing too, too crazy, nothing too out of the blue. But if you do, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, and get it out there. Let make sure everybody knows so we can do